This video is a step-by-step -step guide of how to make 2022 your year. 2022, that is a mouthful. Let's face it, we have had some difficult years in our past, but it's fine. We're gonna move on from this together and it's gonna be our year. I'm gonna show you how. Feel free to support my channel by subscribing. First of all, this is like kind of, this isn't a step one, but like, can I also mention like definitely this year we are treating ourselves. I have a package that arrived and I think it's from the TikTok shop. You know how you get those adverts and it's like 99p, get this. And I was like, let's do it. We're gonna open it. I can't remember what it is. Oh my God. So it's a water bottle. <laughs> It's so big. It's bigger than my head. Can I just say this was 99p? I think, guys, just get the TikTok stuff from TikTok shop. This is massive. Hello. Oh my God, what a bargain. This year, we are going to be drinking a lot of water. We're going to be staying hydrated. And I'm very excited to do this now. I have a water bottle. The first thing I am going to be doing today is definitely tidying my room. You know, they say like, was it clear room, clean mind? And I agree with it. Like my room is an absolute stain. Is, does that surprise me? No, it doesn't. So I definitely recommend putting on some music and just sorting stuff out. If you do struggle with tidying your room, maybe try like corner by corner or section by section, whatever suits you best. Another tip is setting your goals. You can either do this by writing it down or you can even type it up on a computer. I find writing down achievement or like a bucket list for the new year. You could even do it for a new week. I find that writing stuff down really helps. And even if it's just a to-do list, I find it helps a lot. I think from moving on to 2022, I believe that self-care is very important but i rather say self-love i think that i feel like loving yourself like self-acceptance is so important and today i got my mock results back and i'm actually i'm pretty proud of myself i put a lot of effort in so i'm gonna reward myself by making some vegan brownies it's very easy i basically just pour it in and then put it in the oven i've been eating healthy a lot but i feel that you know you need to treat yourself every now and then. Oh my god, this looks so good. I had always saved this pot because I thought it would be nice to make with like friends, but I just like never got around to it. So we're doing it by myself. But I kind of love that though. I feel like it'd be kind of stressful with people. When starting a new hobby or a new interest or for this instance a new year i definitely recommend scrolling through pinterest to try and get some ideas i'm doing this while i'm waiting for my food but i just find it gives me such inspiration and almost motivation to do things it really helps everything on there is just so aesthetically pleasing and it's amazing my favorite app hands down <laughs> I know all I did was just basically pour the ingredients into the bowl, mix it, put it in the oven. But look at this. Wow. That is talent right there. Look at that, you put some raspberries on the side. Looking forward to eating all of this. It tastes really nice as well. For ages, I thought that the best way to settle down was by watching a movie or just browsing on YouTube for ages. But this year, I definitely want to try and read more before going to bed. I am reading Call Me By Your Name. You may say I'm late to the party, but I've had the book for so long, but I've just never had the motivation to actually pick it up and read it. 